Dairy producers from the U.S., Mexico, Canada, Germany, Brazil, and more visited Wisconsin last week for World Dairy Expo. The numbers are in, and it shows that the new format with a shorter expo was a success. It always feels full. You know, it feels like World Dairy Expo is back where we, where we have been in the past and really ready to move forward uh, as an event and as an industry. This year, more than 54,000 people visited World Dairy Expo. 35% were dairy farmers. 38% work in agribusiness, and they also welcomed retired farmers and students eager to learn. So our international numbers are back up to where we expect them to be for World Dairy Expo. So on a typical year, we see about 100 countries represented. Obviously in 21, that was down a little bit with the pandemic. In the Dairy Cattle Show, Expo set a new record for animals housed during the event, topping the 2008 stats. Our trade show has 676 participating companies in it this year. They are representing 24 countries and 44 U.S. states. And of course, they are focusing just on the dairy industry while they're here in Madison. So companies know that the folks that they're talking to are dairy farmers. Dairy farmers know the companies they're talking to have products that can help them. So we see a lot of focus on dairy innovation, sustainability, cow care, um, forage genetics. You know, it's all out in the trade show. If it touches a cow, it's going to be at World Dairy Expo. The event relies on volunteers for success, 460 of them this year. Yes, yes we know World Dairy Expo is built on handshakes and hugs and these moments and the reunions that happen here for 55 years. This is a, a long-term tradition for a lot of people, and yet we still have folks joining us for the first time this year. And it is, it is a reunion for them, you know, whether they're just attendees or if they're exhibiting in the trade show or the Dairy Cattle Show. This is an, a great place for them to meet up. It's where the global dairy industry meets but it's also just a really good family reunion too for folks of all ages. If you are a planner, the dates are already out for next year, kicking off on October 1st.